Lily's underwater adventure once upon a time, in a vibrant seaside town named Oceanville, there stood a magnificent aquarium. Splashed with all colors of the rainbow, the aquarium was filled with all the wonders the ocean had to offer. This spectacular world, brimming with an enchanting array of diverse marine life, attracted many visitors. Young and old could dive into the mysteries of the sea without getting a single drop of water on them. The mastermind behind this underwater marvel was a kind-hearted man named Mr. Fisher. With his warm smile and sparkling eyes, he was the heart and soul of the aquarium. Mr. Fisher was deeply in love with the sea and everything that inhabited it. He dedicated his life to educating visitors about the beauty, diversity, and importance of marine conservation. Mr. Fisher believed that knowledge was a powerful tool. He hoped that by sharing the wonders of the ocean, he could inspire people to cherish and protect these beautiful creatures. One sunny morning, a curious little girl named Lily visited the aquarium. She was instantly intrigued by the colorful world unfolding in front of her eyes. Lily's eyes grew bigger with every step she took inside the grand hall. It was filled with sparkling tanks that housed several species of fish, graceful sea turtles, and even playful dolphins. Being in the presence of such surreal beauty launched Lily into a world beyond her wildest dreams. She felt like she was a part of this watery wonderland, swimming along with the sea creatures. As she wandered through the aquarium, Lily was truly captivated by the vibrant coral reefs. Their diverse colors and unique shapes made her imagination run wild. The sight of seaweed gently swaying back and forth with the water's rhythm was soothing. For Lily, it was like a lullaby that the ocean sang, calming her heart and mesmerizing her senses. Among all the wonders, what fascinated Lily the most were the graceful seahorses. She watched in awe as they danced their way through the cool blue water. Their delicate spiraling movements were like a finely choreographed ballet, telling a fascinating story of life in the deep sea. Lily wished she could join them in their beautiful dance. As Lily immersed herself in the magic of the underwater world, she came across a special exhibition. It was dedicated to the importance of marine conservation, a concept introduced by Mr. Fisher. The exhibit displayed the harmful effects of pollution and overfishing on marine life. The heart-tugging images of distressed sea animals stirred a sense of responsibility in Lily. This new understanding of the harsh reality these creatures face was an awakening for Lily. She realized the importance of protecting this magical world and its inhabitants. Upon leaving the exhibit, Lily asked her parents if they could meet Mr. Fisher. She wanted to learn more about how she could help protect the beautiful creatures she had seen that day. They found Mr. Fisher chatting with some visitors. Seeing the spark in Lily's eyes, he instantly recognized another ocean lover. He welcomed her with a friendly smile and warm words. Mr. Fisher shared many ways in which Lily could contribute to marine conservation. From simple actions like reducing plastic use to participating in beach cleanup activities, every effort mattered. Lily listened intently, absorbing every word. She felt empowered, ready to make a change. She could be a tiny, yet significant ripple in the vast ocean of conservation. As Lily left the aquarium that evening, she brought along a heart filled with deeper understanding and appreciation for marine life. She was no longer just a visitor, she was an ambassador for the ocean. The seeds sown by Mr. Fisher had sprouted in Lily's heart. She became an advocate for conservation, sharing the stories and knowledge she gained with her friends. 
The aquarium continued to be a beacon of knowledge and inspiration. It was a reminder of the marvel that lay beneath the ocean's surface and the importance of preserving it for future generations. Lily's story is a testament to the impact one person can have. Her individual actions sparked a wave of change in her community, all inspired by the magical world within the walls of the aquarium. Mr. Fisher's wish had come true. He had successfully inspired a young mind to appreciate and protect the ocean. Lily's story was just the beginning, proof that the awareness spread in Oceanville's aquarium was truly making a difference. In the end, the aquarium stood not just as a place of wonder and knowledge, but as a symbol of hope. A hope that every visitor, like Lily, would carry this message in their hearts and act upon it, ensuring the ocean and its inhabitants have a safe and secure future.